रिलेटिव एब्सोल्यूट इफ यू एवर वंडर्ड वाई यू ड्रोन मैप डोंट ऑलवेज लाइन अप परफेक्टली विद द रियल वर्ल्ड कोऑर्डिनेट और व्हाई सम प्रोजेक्ट्स नीड अल्ट्रा प्रेसाइज जीपीएस व्हाइल अदर डोंट देन दिस वीडियो इज फॉर यू बाय द एंड ऑफ दिस वीडियो यू विल नो द डिफरेंस बिटवीन दीस टू टाइप्स ऑफ एक्यूरेसी व्हेन ईच वन मैटर्स एंड हाउ टू अचीव देम सो लेट्स डाइव इन so what is relative accuracy relative accuracy refers to how precise measurements are within the map itself it doesn't necessarily match real world gps coordinates but all the distance angle and elevations are correct relative to each other think of it like a scale model of a building the proportion are perfect but if you place it on a map it might not align exactly with the real location for examples where relative accuracy is sufficient number 1 volume measurement for stockpiles number 2 change detection over time comparing two drone surface number 3 3d modeling for visual inspection and many more now let's discuss what is absolute accuracy on the other hand means your map matches real world coordinates with high precision this requires high quality dgps data often using ground control points or rtk ppk drones for example if you are mapping a construction site and need to ensure that the drone data aligns with cad designs or property boundaries you will need absolute accuracy examples where absolute accuracy is critical number 1 legal surveys and cadastral mapping number 2 infrastructure design and as built verification number 3 precise agriculture matching drone data to field sensor now let's discuss the key differences and why they matter relative accuracy internal consistency matter most absolute accuracy matches real world coordinates no gcp is needed requires gcps or rtk ppk drone good for volume change detection needed for legal and engineering a big take away if you just need consistent measurements within your map relative accuracy is enough but if you need to map dgps coordinate for legal or engineering work you will need absolute accuracy let's discuss how to achieve each type for relative accuracy use any consumer grade drone without gcp second ensure good image overlap around 70 to 80% third process in photogrammetric software that is pix4d meta shape drone deploy for absolute accuracy use rtk or ppk enabled drone second place ground control points that is gcps use post processed kinematic that is ppk corrections which one should you use ask yourself do i need this map to match real world coordinates exactly if yes absolute accuracy if no relative accuracy is fine most projects don't need absolute accuracy but when they do it is non negotiable so have you been using relative or absolute accuracy in your project let me know in the comment box if you found this video helpful hit like and subscribe to our channel thanks for watching